performance, and it all started with Sue Bird. Sue Bird staying aggressive, starting off the game looking for a shot, did not score in the second quarter, and still ends with 24 points. Very impressive, and our Jen Mueller is standing by with number 10. Jen? Well, Sue, you helped seal it up. What was the key down the stretch to getting the win? <laughs> Try to figure a way to score. Um, you know, we're up 20 going in the fourth. I don't even know how many. I think we only scored like nine points in the fourth quarter. You know, seven of which were from the free throw line. Luckily, they put us on the line. We were able to end it. This is a pretty big win going into the Olympic break. How important was it to get this one? It was. You know, um, we were 2-2 two and two after that road trip. We really want to end on a good note, uh, get a win in front of our fans, you know, keep things exciting for, for August when we're gone. Now we come back. Hopefully, they'll come back, too. You took a pretty big hit on one of those screens. How are you feeling? I'm all right. Got my clock clean, uh, but I'm cool. <laughs> I know that you are heading to the Olympics. Are you going to have time to think about Storm basketball at all while you're there? Yeah, of course, you know. Um, but I have to say, you know, when I'm with the Storm, I'm with the Storm. Now i got to switch gears a little bit. I'm with USA Basketball, so I'll see you when I get back. All right. Nice game for Super. 24 points heading into the WNBA break. Pretty nice way to go, Kara. Indeed, that is the case, Jen. And three Olympians from the Seattle Storm participating in Beijing. Sue Bird for Team USA, Lauren Jackson for Australia, Kelly Santos for Brazil and from Sacramento, Carolina.